Hello friends, welcome. My name is Miss Lacey and I'm here today from the Howard County Library System for baby games. Today our theme is fall, so we're gonna explore some animals you might see in the fall. Some animals might live in the forest. We're gonna look at some leaves. We're gonna do some counting together, identify some colors, have some fun, do bounces, rhymes, and possibilities are endless. So let's go ahead and get started by saying hello. In order to do that today, we're going to do the hello song and we're going to do a couple of signs as we sing from American Sign Language or ASL. So let's go ahead and see what signs we'll be doing for the hello song. You'll need to know hello, put your hand together off your forehead, hello. We'll need to know friends, one finger up each, friends, hook them together, friends, time. You know, tap like you have a watch. Time to say one finger to your lips and then out to say, and then hello. Let's go ahead and do that together. Are we ready? Hello friends, hello friends, hello friends. It's time to say hello. Should we try it in Spanish next? Hola amigos, hola amigos, hola amigos, es hora de decir, hola. Excellent. Now let's go ahead and get started by waking up some of our body parts. So we're ready to go. We're gonna start with some toe movement and then wiggle our feet. We're gonna make sure we wake up those hands and then every part of ourselves, we are ready to go. So let's start by waking up our toes. Wake up toes, wake up toes, wake up toes and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up toes, wake up toes, wake and wiggle in the morning. Can't forget about those feet. Wake up feet, wake up feet, wake up feet and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up feet, wake up feet, Wake and wiggle in the morning. How about those hands? Get those hands moving. You can clap or wiggle. Wake up hands, wake up hands, wake up hands and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up hands, wake up hands, wake and wiggle in the morning. Now let's wake up all of us. Wake up me, all of me. Wake up me and wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wake up me, all of me. Wake and wiggle in the morning. Oh, it was excellent, my friends. Learning to count can give young children lots of confidence. Numbers are a foundation of mathematics. So let's go ahead and practice some counting together right now. This is a friend you might see during the fall, running around, climbing up the trees, hunting for some acorns. That's right, it's a squirrel. Let's go ahead and count my squirrels together. We have one, two, three, four, and five. Five little squirrels sitting outside my door. One scampered away, and then there were four. Four little squirrels high up in a tree. One ran down, whoosh, and then there were three. Three little squirrels making acorn stew. One went to look for some more acorns, and then there were how many left? Just two, two little squirrels lying in the sun. One found a friend, hey, wait for me. And then there was one, one little squirrel when autumn was done, he went to sleep. And then there was none or zero. Excellent job, my friends. We're gonna go take a walk through the forest. There might be some friends peeking out through the trees, but I need your help finding 
who these friends might be. So we're going to do an activity, a guessing game together, if you will, about animals in the forest to the tune of Hi-Ho the Dario. Are we ready? Who is in the forest? Who is in the forest? Hi-Ho the Dario. Who is in the forest? <gasps> Let's see these birds. This friend looks like they're wearing a mask sometimes. They have a nice stripy tail. You might even hear them digging through your garbage can outside. That's right. It's a raccoon. A raccoon is in the forest. A raccoon is in the forest. Hi ho the dario. Raccoon is in the forest. Let's see who's next. Who is in the forest? Who is in the forest? Hi ho the dario. Who is in the forest? Our next friend likes to hop. They jump. They've got the tiny little nosy wiggles and big long floppy ears. That's right, it's a funny rabbit. A rabbit in the forest, a rabbit in the forest. Hi ho the Dario, the rabbit's in the forest. Oh, we've got some friends left. Who is in the forest? Who is in the forest? Hi ho the Dario, who is in the forest? Our next friend has little spots of white on their back. Sometimes you might see them running with a whole family through the forest. That's right, it's a deer. A deer is in the forest, a deer is in the forest. Hi ho the Dario, a deer is in the forest. Let's see who's next. Who is in the forest, who is in the forest? Hi ho the Dario, who is in the forest? This friend, we just practiced with some counting. This friend likes to climb high in the trees and hide their acorns. They've got big bushy tails. That's right, it's our squirrel friend. A squirrel is in the forest, a squirrel is in the forest. Hi ho the Dario, the squirrel is in the forest. All right, two friends left. Who is in the forest? Who is in the forest? Hi ho the Dario, who is in the forest? Our next friend is orange or brown. It's very quiet and sneaky. That's right, it's a fox. A fox is in the forest. A fox is in the forest. Hi ho the Dario, a fox is in the forest. See if our little friend will hang out. One more friend. Who is in the forest? Who is in the forest? Hi ho the Dario. Who who is in the forest? Who who? Our next friend makes that sound. He likes to sit in the tree. Oh, that's right. It's an owl. An owl is in the forest, an owl is in the forest. Hi ho the Dario, an owl is in the forest. And that is all of our wonderful forest friends that we got to meet today. Thank you for helping me find them. Okay, friends. Songs, rhymes, and chants in class help children to remember things, all kinds of things. It helps them with language, Singing, rhyming, and chanting builds pre-reading skills, and this is excellent for babies as well. Let's go ahead and go to our next rhyme today. This is called the Falling Leaves Song. This is a great one to do together. You can make the motions for some leaves falling. You can rock back and forth with this part if your baby is more into the nice, slow rocking. But if you're making those leaves fall, it's nice to slowly brush all the way down, baby. Nice and soft, gentle tickles and love. So let's go ahead and do this one together. And then on the next part, you'll do some swirling. Falling leaves are falling down, falling down, falling down. Red and yellow, orange and brown, I love autumn. Whirling, twirling, round and round, round.
round and round, round and round, falling leaves down to the ground. I love autumn. Let's do that one one more time together. Falling leaves are falling down, falling down, falling down. Red and yellow, orange and brown. I love autumn. Whirling, twirling, round and round, round and round, round and round. Falling softly to the ground. I love autumn. Excellent job, my friends. While we're here, let's do some classic rhymes as well. Two of my favorites are Smooth Road and I Bound You Here. We'll start with Smooth Road. It's gonna start nice and gentle. Then we're gonna run into some bumps along the way. And it's gonna get pretty rough out there. But most importantly, make sure you watch out for that great big hole. All right, let's get started. A smooth road, a smooth road, a smooth road, a smooth road, a bumpy road, a bumpy road, a bumpy road, a bumpy road, a rough road, a rough road, a rough road, a rough road, a hole. One more time. A smooth road, a smooth road, a smooth road, a smooth road, a bumpy road, a bumpy road, a bumpy road, a bumpy road. A rough road, a rough road, a rough road, a rough road, a hole. Excellent job, friends. Let's go ahead and do I bounce you here. We're gonna bounce and then we'll get some tickles and then we're gonna get some nice big hugs. I bounce you here, I bounce you there, I bounce you, bounce you everywhere. I tickle you here, I tickle you there, I tickle you, tickle you everywhere. I hug you here, I hug you there, I hug you, hug you everywhere. Excellent job, friends. Let's do that one one more time as well. I bounce you here, I bounce you there, I bounce you, bounce you everywhere. I tickle you here, I tickle you there. I tickle you, tickle you everywhere. I hug you here, I hug you there. I hug you, hug you everywhere. Excellent job, my friends. So we saw our friend before the squirrel had a little acorn. It looks like he might have lost it behind one of these leaves. Can you help me count my leaves? We have one, two, three, four, and five. All of these colors are colors of leaves you might see in the fall. Let's go ahead and review some of those colors right now. We have orange, that's right. This one kind of blends in with the background. Oh, it went to fly away. Red yellow, brown, and green. Excellent. So let's find out where our little acorn will be hiding today. Little acorn, little acorn, are you behind the, what color is this one? Red leaf? Oh, no, it's not there. Oh, let's keep looking. Four leaves. Little acorn, little acorn, are you hiding behind the, oh, what color is that? Brown leaf, oh, it's not there, three leaves. Little acorn, little acorn, are you hiding behind the, oh, what color is this? Yellow leaf, no, not behind the yellow leaf. Our squirrel friend really did hide his acorn well. Little acorn, little acorn, are you hiding behind the, hmm, I wanna check this orange one out. The orange leaf, <gasps> and there it is. Wow, excellent job, my friends. I think our little squirrel friend is super happy to have his acorn back. Thank you for your help with that. All right, and our last one, no acorn there, just one green leaf. 
Okay, my friends, we're having so much fun. Rhymes and songs help children develop and understand lots of things about themselves, such as body parts for toddlers, fingers, hands, toes, etc. So let's go ahead and practice some now. This is another great rhyme to do together. This is called Leaves Are Falling to the tune of a very uh, popular song called Jingle Bells, so you might know this one. Go ahead and follow along with me. We're gonna go ahead and have leaves falling on our nose, our toes, our head, and then we're gonna see some different colored leaves together. So let's go ahead and sing to the tune of Jingle Bells. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling, falling on my nose. Touch your nose. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling, falling on my toes. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling, falling on my head. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling. Yellow, orange, and red. Excellent. Let's do that one together again. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling, falling on my nose. Touch your nose. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling, falling on my toes. Wiggle those toes. And leaves are falling, leaves are falling, falling on my head. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling, yellow, orange, and red. Excellent job, my friends. We're gonna go right into another wonderful rhyme about some leaves, where we'll get to do some more counting of our leaves. But right now we have how many on the board already? One, two, three. This is called Little Leaves. And we'll count some together. And then I'm gonna need your help at the end to blow them all away with a big old whoosh of wind. Can you help me with that? Can you practice some wind? Whoosh! We'll blow all the leaves away together. Let's get started. We have one little, two little, three little leaves. Four little, five little, six little leaves. Seven little, eight little, nine little leaves. Blow them all the way. Whoosh! Whoosh! Huh! I feel like our wind needs to be a little bit stronger. Can we try that one again? All right, get all that wind ready to go. One little, two little, three little leaves, four little, five little, six little leaves, seven little, eight little, nine little leaves. Blow them all away, whoosh! Excellent job, friends. Oh, that was so much fun. Learning to count gives your children confidence. You should always find fun ways for adding and subtracting. And let's go ahead and have a look at what that could be like right now. All right. Can you help me count my apples? We have one, two, three, oops, four, and five. But it looks like someone else is interested in our apples. <gasps> Let's see what our friend finds so interesting about our apples. I think our friend might be interested in eating these apples. So this is our Mr. Slinky Worm. 
can we have five little apples hanging in a tree? Five little apples hanging in a tree, teasing Mr. Slinky Worm, you can't eat me. Along comes Mr. Slinky Worm, as quiet as can be, and he crunched an apple right out of that tree. Four apples left. Four little apples hanging in a tree, teasing Mr. Slinky Worm, you can't eat me. Along comes Mr. Slinky Worm, as quiet as can be, and he crunched an apple right out of that tree. Three apples. Three little apples hanging in a tree, teasing Mr. Slinky Worm, you can't eat me. Along comes Mr. Slinky Worm, as quiet as can be, and he crunched an apple right out of that tree. Two apples left. He must be really hungry. Two little apples hanging in a tree, teasing Mr. Slinky Worm, you can't eat me. Along comes Mr. Slinky Worm, as quiet as can be, and he crunched an apple right out of that tree. Just one apple. I have a feeling he's gonna eat this last apple too. What do you think? Do you think he's gonna eat the last one? Yes, me too. One little apple hanging in a tree, teasing Mr. Slinky Worm, you can't eat me. Along comes Mr. Slinky Worm, as quiet as can be. And he crunched the last apple right out of that tree. Excellent job, my friends. Thank you so much for helping me count my apples. There is no longer any on the board, so there is none or zero left once again. And now it is time to say goodbye. So we're gonna use some signs that we learned in the beginning of this class for American Sign Language. So we're gonna practice some of the same ones together and learn a new one for goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Friends, one finger up, pointer finger on each hand, bring them together, friends, friends. Time to say goodbye. All right, friends, let's do this together. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Let's do it in Spanish. Adios, amigos. Adios, amigos. Adios, amigos. Es hora de decir. Adios. Thank you so much, friends, for hanging out with me today. I hope you have a wonderful fall and find some nice crunchy leaves to jump in. I'm Miss Lacey with the Howard County Library System, and this has been a wonderful time with you for baby games. Thank you.